London. In order to make the global COVID-19 vaccination program successful, the available vaccines must be able to do all three of prevent infection becoming established in an individual, prevent disease progression and prevent onward transmission, say researchers. Whether all three of these goals will be met by first-generation vaccines is not known, but is vital to the long-term success of the program, said the study published in the journal Anesthesia. Preventing onward transmission, referred to as sterilizing immunity is particularly important as it is epidemic-modifying, said the UCS Influential Scientific Advisory Group for Emergencies, SAGE, Committee. It is possible that the first vaccines, including those being released now, may be more effective in preventing disease progression and hospitalization and less effective in preventing transmission, explained study senior author Jeremy Farah from SAGE. Knowledge of their performance in pre-approval trials and in surveillance trials after licensure will enable further modifications such that improved second and third generation vaccines may be available later in 2021 and beyond, Farah added. They also emphasize the importance of prioritizing those most vulnerable and healthcare workers before the wider population. The author stated, vaccination is a global rather than a national necessity. The World Health Organization, WHO, ACT Accelerator and COVAX initiatives both emphasize the importance of vaccines reaching the most vulnerable and healthcare workers in all countries at a similar time. Widespread vaccination of one or a few countries without addressing this need globally is in no one's interests and will not provide the protection we all need. No country has mounted a whole population vaccination campaign in living memory, and it will need to be undertaken with local leadership and cultural sensitivity, the experts stressed. They also discussed the implications of the widespread vaccination and the challenges for those who don't get vaccinated. They asked, will a certificate of vaccination, a vaccine passport, be a requirement for patients and their families before elective surgery? or to work in the health or social care, to travel abroad, or to attend medical conferences, or even to participate in the Olympics? The authors make clear the vaccine is not a panacea, and that SARS-CoV-2 will only be brought fully under control by also continuing to adapt our behavior, plus better access to diagnostics and treatments, but at, safe and effective vaccines will undoubtedly change the trajectory of the pandemic. We really are all in this together, they concluded. Please support my channel to grow by pressing subscribe button and the bell icon. We notify your new science updates. Thank you.